something over it till it's over. Where's that from? The 80s? It's probably in the 70s. Sylvester Stallone has been working hard to bring us Rocky 7 for quite some time, and it looks like it might finally happen after Creed 3. Let's dive into what we know about the upcoming movie. Sylvester Stallone's Rocky 7 is looking more likely after Creed 3, and there are good reasons for the franchise to continue. Michael B. Jordan has taken the lead in the Creed series, gaining popularity with the success of the trilogy centered around Adonis Creed. In Creed 3, Sylvester Stallone's Rocky Balboa was not part of the story, a departure from the earlier six Rocky films. Despite his absence, questions about Rocky's life were sparked by the movie's plot, generating increased curiosity among audiences for Stallone's return. If Sylvester Stallone is to play Rocky Balboa again, it's likely to happen in Rocky 7. Despite hurdles, this seems to be the best chance for Stallone, who has expressed his disinterest in playing Rocky as a supporting character in Creed 4 or any spin-offs. Shouldn't you be thinking about something else, wise guy? Hey, go prove it. Now go get your Mustang back. Creed 3's success could pave the way for Stallone's return in Rocky 7, fulfilling his long-standing desire to continue the Italian Stallion story. The notion of Rocky 7 has been around for years, originating after the surprising success of Rocky Balboa in 2006. The film received positive reviews and performed well at the box office, signaling a potential revival for the Rocky franchise. Serious talks about Rocky 7 gained momentum after the Creed movies successfully rejuvenated the series. However, the main obstacle preventing Rocky 7 from materializing has been the complications involving franchise producer Erwin Winkler. Winkler holds some rights to Rocky Balboa's character, but his strained relationship with Stallone over the years has been a significant roadblock. Stallone has accused Winkler of hindering the development of Rocky 7, claiming that the producer halted the project when asked to share in its financial success. Despite Winkler's control over Rocky's rights, efforts are being made to work on the film, with hopes that the issues can be resolved for the project to move forward eventually. The possibility of Rocky 7 happening after Creed 3 is closely tied to Amazon's interest in expanding the franchise. Amazon has already announced plans for Creed 4 and is exploring various spin-offs, including an anime series. While these projects are centered around Michael B. Jordan's character, it would be a missed opportunity for Amazon not to leverage Sylvester Stallone's Rocky Balboa further. Stallone has hinted at a potential show exploring Rocky's origin, but a larger and more impactful move would be the creation of Rocky 7, starring Sylvester Stallone. The encouraging news is that whenever Rocky 7 comes to fruition, Stallone already has the story meticulously planned. Development began in 2019, and snippets of the narrative have been revealed, forming the basis for the screenplay. The film is designed to harken back to the Rocky franchise's roots, focusing on Balboa's immigrant background. Rocky encounters Chucho the Mutt, a young foreign boxer stuck in America illegally, and the story delves into the bond that develops between them. Additionally, it sheds light on how Rocky copes with Adrian's death. Given that much of the narrative is already outlined, the movie could potentially come together relatively quickly. Another compelling reason for Sylvester Stallone to return to Rocky 7 is that Rocky Balboa's role in the Creed movies has concluded. The first two films showcased the strong bond between Rocky and Adonis, but Creed 2 concluded with them parting ways. Rocky's Creed storyline wrapped up with him heading to Vancouver to spend time with his son, Robert Balboa Jr., and his family. Having fulfilled his purpose in Adonis' life by training him to become a champion, and with Adonis now retired, a significant motivation for Rocky's return has diminished. Sylvester Stallone's absence in Creed 3 serves as a strong indicator that Rocky 7 is more likely to come to fruition after this movie. It suggests that there may not be a significant role for Stallone in the ongoing spin-off franchise. Having Rocky return in Creed 4 might feel forced, considering the character would have missed key life events such as Marianne's death and Adonis re-entering the ring, leading to potential confusion. On the other hand, Stallone's involvement in Rocky 7 would offer a natural way to delve into more aspects of the character's life and place him back at the center of the narrative. The occurrence of Rocky 7 following Creed 3 could also provide an opportunity for the franchise to address lingering questions about Rocky Balboa. 
The film might reintroduce some characters from Rocky's past and resolve storylines between them and Balboa. For instance, it could explore the strained relationship between Rocky and Robert Balboa Jr., bridging the gap between Rocky Balboa and Creed II. Properly delving into their falling out becomes crucial, particularly as Rocky has formed a close father-son bond with Adonis. Additionally, Rocky VII's storyline could be timely, especially in the aftermath of Mary Ann's death in Creed III. Sylvester Stallone envisions exploring how Rocky continues to process Adrian's death. While Rocky might have believed he had properly grieved and moved on over the years, learning about the passing of Apollo Creed's wife and Adonis' adopted mother could bring forth suppressed emotions related to his own wife's demise. This unintentional connection to Creed III could give Rocky VII a poignant link and offer an explanation for Stallone's absence in the earlier film. Rocky VII holds the potential to pave the way for additional spin-offs on Amazon, especially considering the introduction of the new fighter Chucho the Mutt, whom Rocky assists in training. If Rocky VII effectively portrays the bond between the two characters and generates genuine audience affection for Chucho, it creates an opportunity for him to have his own spin-off. Amazon could explore a new franchise spin-off similar to Creed, focusing on the Mexican boxer and potentially allowing him to intersect with characters like Felix Chavez in the future. The film's success in building a compelling narrative for Chucho could open avenues for further storytelling within the Rocky universe on the streaming platform. Creating Rocky VII after Creed III provides an opportunity to bring closure to Rocky Balboa's character arc. Sylvester Stallone has witnessed multiple pseudo-endings for Rocky throughout the film series, with Rocky V, Rocky Balboa, and Creed II all presenting potential conclusions to the Italian Stallion's journey. Despite these attempts, Stallone has returned for more. Rocky VII has the potential to serve as the definitive farewell for Stallone's iconic character, offering Rocky Balboa a proper and conclusive goodbye. In addition, Stallone has explored expanding the Rocky universe through other mediums. In July 2019, he revealed ongoing discussions about a Rocky prequel television series intended for a streaming service. Although there were hesitations from film series producer Erwin Winkler due to concerns about adapting the story for television, Stallone began working on the script for a prequel series set in the 1960s. Despite facing complications, the project gained traction when Amazon acquired MGM, identifying the Rocky franchise as a valuable asset. Stallone's prequel script, previously rejected, is now back in development, thanks to Amazon's involvement. The streaming giant intends to expand the franchise with various projects, including Stallone's prequel series, with the actor expected to play a role in its development. Stallone's collaborative contract with Balboa Productions, MGM, and Amazon Studios further solidifies the commitment to exploring various television and film projects within the Rocky universe. This broader storytelling approach aligns with the potential for Rocky VII to provide a fitting and conclusive end to Stallone's portrayal of the beloved character. Finally, in May 2023, Michael B. Jordan shared exciting news about an anime-styled animated short linked to Creed III. This unique project was unveiled to audiences in Japan as part of the post credit scene. Directed by Yo Moriyama, with a script co-written by Katsuhiko Manabe and Kensaku Kojima, the animated short is a collaborative effort between TMS Animation and Outlier Society Productions. Inspired by Michael B. Jordan's fondness for manga and anime, he integrated these artistic elements into scenes in his directorial feature film. Motivated by his passion for the genre, Jordan took a step further by commissioning the animation studio to create a short that could be attached to the end of Creed III. Creed Shinji Dai, the officially titled short film, had its debut in Japan on May 26, 2023. It later saw a limited theatrical release in the United States on September 22, 2023, with plans for a worldwide premiere at a later date. And that's that for today's video. Thanks for watching and we will see you in the next one. Your suggestions for future videos are always welcome in the comments down below.